In this repair video, we're going to be working on a MacBook 15 inch. This is probably the mid 2010 model. It's the A22915 board. I already took the board out. Laptop does not turn on. Uh, we do see a green light on the charger, but it doesn't turn on. Let me plug the charger in right now. As you can see, we do have a green light. I'm looking at the power supply and the amps being drawn by the power supply is 0 0.074. So there is no amps being drawn and the board is not turning on. We do not see any fan spin. We do not see anything, nothing hot on the board. So the first thing that we do anytime we are troubleshooting a MacBook that doesn't power on is we go through the voltage rails to see what is missing or what is short or what is not displaying the right voltage. PP bus G3 hot is present because we do have a green light, so we do not need to even test this. If PP bus G3 hot was not present, then we're not going to get uh, 3.42 volts, which is the green light on the charger. DC in, we do not need to test that because uh, DC in is what makes PP bus G3 hot, so that is present. 3V42 is present because we have a green light. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to test PPV RTC G3 hot. And let's see if we have it. And yes, we do. Let's test PP5V S5. And that should be right over here. We do have it. Let's test PP5V SUS. Should be somewhere over here. And we have zero. So that's where our problem is. So we do not have PP5V SUS. Let's see where this voltage is coming from. And right over here. This circuit here is what makes PP5V SUS. Uh, we must have this voltage present here and we must have uh, PM SUS enabled in order for this circuit to work. So let's go ahead and see if we have PP5V S5, this one here. And then we're gonna see if we have PM SUS enabled. If enable is not present, then the whole circuit is not gonna work. And we're gonna be testing pin number one because that's where PM SUS enable is at. Pin number one is right over here. And we do not have PM SUS enable. Pin number two is a ground, which is this one here. And then pin number three is five, 4.9. Do we have a short on PM SUS enable? Let's see. Meter in diode mode. Red probe on ground and black probe on pin number one. And we do not have a short. So let's go back to the circuit to see where PM SUS enable is coming from. So we do have this voltage coming in here and we do not have PM SUS enable. So that's our problem right here. Let's see where PMSUS enable is coming from. PMSUS enable is needed to make the circuit work and output PP5V SUS. PMSUS enable, let's search for it. And it's coming from this little circuit here. This circuit consists of uh, the IC U7940. The IC is powered by PP3V3S5, so if this voltage is not present, the chip is not going to turn on and nothing is going to work. We must have this voltage here. SMC bat low L will only be present if we have a battery connected. Since we do not have a battery connected right now, we do not need to worry about this one. And we must have PM SLP SUS L present. So let's test to see if we have this and if we have this. If either one of them is missing, then we're not going to get the PM SUS enabled to power the other circuit that we looked at. 
So we do have PM, SLP, SU, SL. And we do have PP3, P3, S5 powering the chip, which is the U7940. The only thing that can be causing no output here is U7940. Let's go ahead and change this chip. And I'm almost 99% positive that this will fix our problem, considering there's no other issues with the laptop. We're going to get the port from a donor board. But before we do that, let's remove that component from the board. Okay, and that chip is right over here. That tiny little chip. Let's remove it. Let's remove that off the donor board. gonna put it right over here how to fix uh, we're open until six all right Let's test. So PMSUS enable. We are now getting 3.3 volts. And then PMSLPSUSL. We have 3.3 volts. And VCC for the chip, which is PP3V3S5. And that's pin number five, which is right over here. That's it, we're all good.
doesn't have to be perfect now, I just want to test it. Okay, and the computer power down. Problem is fixed. And that was what was causing the problem. U7940, we were missing PMSUS enable. Now we have it, and the computer is on. I do not have a hard drive, so nothing is gonna show up on the screen. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Leave a comment if you have any questions and I will see you in the next video.